All four candidates who filed nomination paper for the loan Lok Sabha seat of Nagaland is found valid, informed Nagaland Commissioner and Returning Officer Yam Batond after examination of documents with scrutiny been completed. The four candidates include Tokehu Yeptomi, NDPP, KL Chishi, INC, Hayedong Tungyo, NPP, and Dr. Yam Yam Tromwa Gonyak, Indian Christian Secular Party. However, Dr. Tromwa had failed to produce the original signed copy of Form A and B issued by the concerned parties, prompting the RO to inform that the former has to contest as independent candidate if he chooses to remain in the race. Scrutiny of candidate for the by-election to 26 Anglongdent Assembly constituency was also conducted by the SDOC Mukukchong. All four Alim Jongshi Longkumer INC, Sharingain Longkumer NDPP, Toshi Pogba Longkumer NPF and Otinu Jongshi Longkumer NPP were found valid. The last date for withdrawal of candidature for both elections is March 28. The chief election officer Abhijit Sinha also informed that final electorate count for Lok Sabha pool in the state is 12,13,777, while the same for 26 and Long Dent AC is 12,482. 2,227 polling stations will be in play for the Lok Sabha pool, while 16 will be activated for the by election. There are 255 all women polling teams for the general election to Lok Sabha. So far, 19,038 liters of liquor, nearly rupees 70 lakh in cash, and six arms have been seized. Meanwhile, 605 persons have been bound down under preventive section till date, and 1,879 arms license have been deposited. Regarding scrutiny measures, Sinha said that the first batch of the Central Armed Police Forces company have already arrived in the state comprising CRPF, SSB and BSF. Another batch of CAPF will be arriving on March 30th or 31st. Home guards and village guards will be supplemented. Altogether, 450 polling stations are considered as critical and vulnerable. Within Zangbe Mukhuvum, Kohima.